Good morning, my friends. So today is Wednesday. Today is my Monday because I was uh, I took Monday off. I needed it, and it was bad weather outside. All right, today's message basically it's a powerful one. It's basically we're going to talk about power. Knowledge is power, but the guts to do it. That's the powerful part. You see, we can retain information good as humans, but then we get scared. Our anxiety kicks in and we are afraid to hurt somebody. So we don't use the power to help people or to get over our fears of things. One of my seasonable friends or spiritual people that I met around a year or two ago, more like two years ago, he's gone now. But he did teach me that you have to speak up for yourself. It's okay to have fun. But always, when you have a plan, always try to stick to it. It helps you grow mentally, physically, and spiritually. Well, the physical part, I still have to work on because I'm short. But the thing is, you never give up on life. You know, everything's going to always be a challenge, but if you can tr be true to your principles, nobody else's, because you're always going to get judged on a level or two in life more than others because they think you got more chances and stuff, but they don't realize all the things you had to go through. But that's a good thing, because when you have the knowledge and the power and the guts to do it, you will. It's in your time, nobody else's, and God's. Because we're all different snowflakes. We're not meant to be the same snowflake. And if people p always put us in categories or say this isn't the way this should be, it's like it's the way you think it should be, not mine. So that's a good thing. You find the same people, that's what we call tribe members of the, your group. It's hard to find. I mean, I let go of a lot of people in the last couple of years. Last night, I had to say goodbye to a nice lady because she's moving to New York. But I think she needs to get out of Connecticut to make her life better. But she gave me, she goes, you got confident. I go, it's after doing things and feeling successful, the confidence grows over time. Because when you also have born with people picking on you, you get low self-esteem. It's hard to overcome, but you got to remember, I've been working with a person that's helping me understand and change the way I think a little bit to be healthier. And I needed that. I still do. I think everybody on some level needs something. But that's not my place to tell you what to do. If it was, I wouldn't be where I am now either. I just want to let you know, power and the guts to do it and knowledge is great. But you need the guts and you need not to be afraid of what people will say. And once you get there, you okay. Remember, not every day going to be good. But you take that lemon and you make that lemonade out of it. I love you, my friends. Auntie Sue.